gold in the ground under my feet. My sermon for today is something worked hard, though not long. I made it from hard experience and guilt. So let's hope it's any good. The subject, scripture's hid treasure. In our youth, it's grasped so little. We're so small in our Sunday school classrooms. Care as small as our frames. Some at their ends have the same state. They grew small, care as their souls. We cannot know this pagan apathy. So what is this story? Passage. This parable, let me tell you, conviction in words, gold and true. His word says it, divine kiss, field hidden treasure. His realm is. Treasure worthy of man's whole worth to sell, to buy that plot of earth. Gold uncovers, gems he reveals, Lord under cover, he rightly steals. Our treasure, him who satisfies, who gladly came and gladly died. Kingdom of heaven is come hidden, our blessed Son of God, love bidden. What simple verse, whimsical word, our Christ gave to be gladly heard. A bettering gift, gracious bestowing, tis when we leave knowing. The problem. I have not known this parable, so shame writes these words. Around, not within, has this joy welled up. My present state does not meet its end, so disappointment reigns. Yet my downcasts, not this story's mold. Yet we've all missed the parable before, and missed the ignition of life in our cold bones. Oh, it shined through the scales of our eyes, yet we comprehend it not. Conviction ought be life at this point. The questions. So then, are we ignorant of the Savior's might? Are we bored whenever he speaks of hidden treasure? Or by faith do his words cross centuries to spellbind our hearts? Lit or unlit by fire are our ears. Am I, ask, O oh brother, struck by my Savior's value? Does the man in the parable fit our estate? Do we speed to sell all our goods for him our hearts cry after, our souls chained in Christian frenzy? As the sun to his sons is our look in desperate love. Do we fear loving him as he so first loved us? Does the long walk homeward to sell our goods intimidate us? Either way, we cannot fear then lack love. Three action points. Our love must be as full as we are full of his love. The field is bought when Christians are worshiping well. We need kindling, rekindling, so perspire with fire for our Lord. This is loving him right. Be transfixed in his words and this living story. Let him hate your grim estate and love you so. In your awful service, he will fill you with ghostly fire. Abide in this treasure. Transfixed, don't sit. In love, don't wait. Sell all your worth for his great gift. Wholly complete, knowing him, your costly gem, get you up and go. The final prayer. Work, for your faith from love must do. Finding gems, let them cut you. Finding gold, smelt you. In all that you do, let the dross be done away, lackings be moot, for the perfect is come and we have found it. Do not lose the fire of God.